Hello and welcome to an episode of Rick's Automotive Diagnostics. Today I'm going to be showing you how to initiate the gauge cluster diagnostic test within the Honda HDS. So today I'm going to be working in a 2014 Acura RDX. I already have my Honda HDS um, plugged in right here. It's just in the, the data link port. Once that is done, you just want to obviously just start your vehicle up just like what I have here. Turn the engine on. Now we're going to move over to my computer right here. Mm, once once you've initialized your all of your um once you've opened up the Honda Diagnostic program, as you can see in here, I have I've launched my um so this is what the program looks like. Obviously you want to now press go to go to the system page. As you can see in the system selection menu, you want to go to body electrical and press enter. And then inside the body electrical menu, just want to give it a couple seconds. We're gonna go into gauges, press enter again. And then you want to go into functional tests and as you can see in the function test help it just says this is this initially sorry this initiates the drive indicator circuit check so we're just going to go ahead and press enter and run it and when i press enter or when i press the little green check mark right there you're going to see that the gauges move as you can see we're just going to press enter to start the test just like that All right, so as you can see in my example here, it says the F CAN bus has an error and the, and the slow CAN bus is okay. That is because I actually have an all wheel drive DTC in my vehicle and that causes the fast CAN bus to shut itself down. So now um, this is just a very simple test um, to just to see if you have any DTCs. If you have any DTCs in your vehicle, then the fast CAN bus will turn itself off and it will say error right up there. If you want to make the um, if you want to make the needle cycle one more time, you could just press the select reset button on your steering wheel. It could be in the, it could be in um, any location. Just look for this, this button that says cell reset on here. Press it, and the gauges will cycle once more. All right. In order to exit the test, you can just press enter again, and then if once you press enter. It will just return to its normal mode, just like that. And that's how you run the diagnostic test in your 2014 Acura RDX. This will work for any, any Honda or Acura vehicle, to be honest. Anyway, thanks for watching.